So, what we're doing here is uh, we're making these tabs. These prevent uh, a jam that happens between the uh, fuser and the drum there. Uh, you'll Anyway, so what the so that stops that you probably have noticed like sometimes the paper is wrinkled right in between like I said the uh, drum and going into the fuser. This is like a, a paper guide basically that's what this is. So I'm going to show you how to make one of these, and actually you're going to make two of them, one for each side, and I'll show you how to insert these also. So basically we have a piece of metal here. This is a uh, metal that you can buy at the hardware store. goes for eaves. You know, metal siding. You know, you buy a roll of this pretty cheaply. So what I want to do is approximately about a half inch width there. And then you just want to cut it all the way to the end. Just snips. And after that, you want to take them and mark them about two inches or so and cut a bunch of them. And after that, what you want to do is you want to fold it over, bend it over with your needle nose twice. After you do fold this, the total length should be one and three-eighths of an inch. Okay approximately okay and then you want to curve it a little bit like so okay and then you'll be able to insert this into the machine like I said here you got your thing and I'm gonna put one on the inner side of this tab there you see above the drum the screw there and I'm gonna push that down behind the black strip there little roll of guides and so you see there, it's one there and then it's going to be the same on the other side there too so I will show you that okay so like I said oops so like I said you have the one I just showed you, and then you put another one over here on this side, right on the inner side of it, again of these two tabs. Or the screw, the silver screw mounts there. You see? And that's how you insert them. So now when your paper, that will guide your paper up into the fuser, fixing film fuser, and not just get hit and get jammed in here. Again that's also good with uh, humidity too. Okay. And uh, thank you very much.